So to get to the level that you're at, there's so many people kind of along the way that build you up. Who comes to mind to help you along to get to Driver in the Cup Series? Yeah, the name that comes to mind the most is probably uh, Dennis Lambert. He was my legend car crew chief and um, really took me under his wing. He has a shop out in Indian Trail. He took care of my cars and, and took me to every race. What's it like when you're so young to have someone like that kind of as a mentor or maybe just having someone in your corner? The confidence as a driver is key, so you got to have the confidence to, to kind of go out there and do what you need to do. And He was always there kind of coaching me. Uh, it was tough at the beginning. He didn't really want to work with me because I was so fresh and so clean. I had no races under my belt, and uh, it took a little bit of time, but he kind of uh, developed me as a driver. Did you turn out? <laughs> hey, What's up? Good to see you, love. Nice to see you. That's awesome. <laughs> So I'll flip it real quick. You've worked with so many different race car drivers. He, he didn't have a lot of experience, kind of off my racing a little bit. What is it about him? I mean, he's so fast, so good. I mean, he just picked it up right away. He always had speed in the car. You know, usually as a crew chief, you know, normally the crew chiefs can't drive the car, but I can do that a little bit. And he's the only one that I couldn't ever just like, well, let me get in there and show you how it's done then. You knew then he was gonna be pretty good. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna pick on William here, right? Soft-spoken, polite kid. What was your first opinion? He first came over to my shop, walked in, and he had a notepad and a pen. So he was there to take notes. So I was like, okay, this is a little different, but he takes notes, and as you guys know, I mean, he, he really studies on what he's doing and learns from it. I don't think I was even too red where I hit 59.7, you know? Yeah. What's it been like watching him, everything he gets in, right? I mean, wins, contends for championships. Awesome, awesome, John. I mean, it's amazing. I was down there in Homestead whenever he won the X-Fan Championship. The 19-year-old rookie phenom, William Byron, is the Xfinity Series champion. Probably one of the coolest things. He was one of the first guys to the car after uh, when I did the burnout and kind of jumped out of the car. So that, that was pretty special. I can't believe it. Wow. I mean, races become battles, but you learn a lot about life along the way. What did it mean just to spend time together? There's a really clear memory when we went up to New York. So we hoping to win, like, hopefully four out of five or something like that. We were like, okay, we got to win this race. And I just remember him defending me when we crashed with the leader or something. The guy chopped me off. Dennis is out there, and I can see him off turn two, just, like, yelling at the official to, to keep me out front. So I just remember those moments and how he was there for me. Didn't know he seen me over there arguing, but maybe that didn't work out so well that time. Somebody's got to fight for him. Right? That's right. And I was there ready to do that. Great stuff.